Who sits on defense when Shea Weber and David Schlemko return to the lineup? It's a good question. I, I think it might be they might do it on a rotating basis because you know, you got a guy like Jordy Ben now is playing 22 minutes a game, playing a ton of hockey, and I'm sure it wouldn't hurt to have him sit a little bit, get a get a little bit of a rest. So it's going to be a tough decision. I mean, Xavier Wallet's played really well. There was a guy who came to the training camp. Nobody expected him to earn a job. He earned the job. He's kept his job, put Carl Alsner up in the press box. So it's going to be a tough decision, but um, I guess Xavier Wallet maybe, but I can see them sort of rotating it to try and keep defenseman fresh through the season. And the rotating option would be the best way, I think because of the young guys that they have, Victor Mete, Noah Juleson, Xavier Ouellette, that you don't want these guys sitting up in the press box for too long. And especially David Schlemko, he's not part of the Habs long-term plan. So why would you, you know, take away experiences that these younger defensemen could get for him? But, you know, if you rotate it, I think that's the best bet to just spread it around and everyone kind of get the even playing time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Be nice to everybody. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's not happening. It's not happening. That's not a winning formula. And um, yeah, I, I'd say Jordy Ben or Ulet. That's what it looks like. That's probably the easiest thing for the coach. Not that he wants it easy, but those are the guys I think that at times you may see going in and out. Um, yeah, and it might start with um, Jordy Ben. Yeah, because what do you do with Carl Alsner? I mean, at some point, you do they send them to Laval? Or you guys got to got to play somewhere. That's another question that comes in. The other thing that was whoever isn't playing, after morning skates or practices, you always see Luke Richardson working with the healthy scratches. And I think it would like if it's a young guy, if they sat a young guy for a game or two to give him extra time to work with Luke Richardson, I don't think it would be the worst thing in the world that would happen either. So, no, I still think they might rotate it. But Knuckles, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Knuckles knows more than I do. <laughs> it's not the worst problem to have. Go to HockeyInsideOut.com now and check out this week's full episode.